Hey, I'm JC Frias. I'm from Texas, living in Utah, with my partner of three years and our pets. I love hosting dinner parties and gatherings, and enjoy making everything look adorable in my home. Join me on learning some tips of doing it yourself and being creative. Hey everyone, it's JC here, just doing a quick video with my little buddy Winston here to help me. Don't know how much help he'll be, but hopefully you guys enjoy this video. It is my uh, US flag Americana banner, easy to do. This is probably going to be the easiest decorations that you have ever done for the 4th of July or any of those summer barbecues that you got going on. And it's a super, 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 super cheap um, project. So hopefully you guys love it and leave me some comments of what you think about it. Let's get started. So for this super cute, super easy project, you will need the following supplies. American flags, a ruler, scissors, tacky glue you can find at Michael's Hobby Lobby, burlap, a marker, and twine. Okay, so these flags I got at Target and they were three for a dollar. I told you, super cheap. And so what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna lay out your burlap just like I have here, get your ruler out, and you're gonna to wanna to make sure you cut about an inch and a half on each side of it, top, bottom, side, and side of the rectangle burlap squares, okay? So that's your first project to do. So what you're gonna do now is get your tacky glue and put it at the very top of the burlap rectangle square and just um, give a good dab. After that, you want to grab your twine that you got. Make sure you have enough string at the beginning of it so you can tie it up and then you're just going to press that down and fold it over. You probably don't have enough glue on this but at least it'll keep the burlap string there. After you've pressed it down and got that crease going, add more of that tacky glue on there and on both sides so that way you can press it down and it can get stuck together and it can stay really good, okay? Last step of these super cute banners is position your flag, put your tacky right where you want it, put that flag back on there and do the opposite side. After this, that it's nice and even, start with the other ones. So I just added these little banners or flags to my Americana section in my home. I think they look darling. It was super easy, it probably cost me about $3 to make, and you can make very long ones and decorate your backyard, your home, or whatever you wanna do for the 4th of July or any summer barbecues coming up. Hope you guys enjoyed, follow me on Facebook, check me out on Instagram, and I look forward to doing more videos. Have a great day, thanks you guys, bye.